baseball fans, and welcome. MLB The Show's Game of the Week is coming your way. The Atlanta Braves taking on the Tampa Bay Rays. With my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomby. And today is draft day, Singy. An exciting day in terms of the future of the sport and the future of these teams. Boog, what's changed in baseball is that draft picks are going to get to the big leagues a lot sooner. They're going to be tracked every step of the way, and they're going to be expected to have an impact. So for teams, they have to get it right because there's nowhere to hide in terms of what did you do with the information, who did you select, and how have you brought them through your system. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. All right, just about ready for baseball. For and on the mound for Tampa Bay in this one, one, Jeffrey Spring. What do you have on him, Yeah, he battled through season. seven innings last time out. He pitched well enough to get the win thanks to that offense. He'll look to turn in another quality start in this one. Next pitch misses, and the count's full. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch, and I tell you what, he earned that walk. 3-2. Swing and a ball popped up. Loud flashes the leather on the run and catch. Here's Austin Riley. One run batted in. Here comes the pitch. There goes the runner from first. Strike in there. Throw. Safe. Mejia too late. Good steal a second right there, and now the table is set for the middle of this order to drive in the first mm -hmm. run of this ball game. Ah, uh, ground ball, and that's the field. Randy. Now a long throw home. And he's in there. And a run comes in to score. Oh, that was a great job of letting that runner steal second base, get in the scoring position, come through with the base knock, you add a run. Matt Olson up to the plate. When you think about the best defensive first baseman of the game, Olson is certainly in the conversation. He's won multiple gold gloves over there, and it seems like he picks everything. One of those guys that the infielders love because he makes that third baseman, shortstop, and second baseman even better, saving those errors. Next offering is fouled back. 3-2 on the way. Good job to fight that one off. Well, lots of pitches thrown in this first inning, and it's kind of that nightmare scenario for starting pitching. But you know what? It's still early enough. He can settle in. He can get some length if he just cleans up his mechanics a little bit. Next pitch is downstairs. There's a strike. Swing at a high fly ball left field. A Rosarena right there to make the grab. And the inning is over. So one run in the inning on this base hit. It's now. And now here is Randy A Rosarena. Oh. And now two balls and a strike. Two balls, one strike. Foul ball there. I want to start that load a little bit sooner because of the good velo. And the pitch. This one high in the air to left center. Ozuna should have it. And puts the squeeze on that. And there's one down. Taylor Walls getting ready to hit. Good defender. He's been inconsistent offensively. Swings and misses. And the count is one and two. Home team down a run as the Rays try and punch back down a run the one one is fouled off good eye right there next one misses and the counts full recognize that change up right out of the hand just spit on it Fly drive, yeah, let's and that should be extra balls. bases. Hot, kid. Now he turns and heads for second. Is that Matt Olson? And he's in with a stand-up double. Love how he became a really tough out with two strikes right there. Ripped that one down the line and kept it fair. And even when you hit it that far out front, you still have to keep your hands tight to your body so you don't hook around that baseball and put it in foul territory. And that right there was perfect. 
Walls. The runner at second with one away. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Gassed it right by him. And now it's Brandon Lau. Seventh right now in the American League home run leaderboard. The 2 1. And that one fouled off. And now it's filled up. Well, they're really running up the pitch count in this first inning. Lots of confidence from this team that is perhaps the hottest in baseball right now. Curtis Mead to bat next. Three two now. So now two on and two outs. I don't think he really wanted to pitch to him right there anyhow. First and second two down. So next to the plate for Tampa Bay Curtis Mead. And one and two. This is where Harry should be batting. In the dirt blocked. Nothing happening on the bases though. Two outs. A couple of base runners at first and second. Next offering is fouled back. Too early. Good one. The two two. One down the line, and it's just foul. That was close. At the belt and fires. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Two less. So close. Game of inches, they say. New inning getting started. So here's Murphy now. The Braves are so good offensively. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Foul ball, another 2 2 upcoming. And here it comes. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Kicks and fires. The other way, and it goes just foul. Him looking for the K. Here's Orlando Arcia. The pitch. And a count. Do you want to send me your um, Pokemon Go on the in the chat so that I can just write it down? The one one is fouled off. One down, base is empty. Spoils the two strike pitch and he'll see another. Still in the second, already at 44 pitches, so some concern there. Nope. Misses, and it's two and two. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Pulled the string on the changeup. Ozzy Albies up to the plate. He had him out in front, which isn't easy to do against a hitter like this, known for using the entire field. Just couldn't sit back long enough on that one. Well, that was one of those high percentage advantage counts where batting averages are just so much higher. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. Albies off of first with two away. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. Double, Jeff. Swing Good and a pitch. miss, and he struck him out. Third out. Back now in Tampa okay. Bay, Harold Ramirez at the dish. Off the plate, two balls and a strike. The two on is high. 
Umpiring behind the plate for us today, Boog, is Mike Fillmore, and he is a good one. He'll reward pitches on the edges a little bit, but the main thing is he doesn't keep you guessing. Once he established that a pitch is a strike, it stays that way. Yeah, Fillmore, kind of, I don't know, you'd say maybe an umpire's umpire, but really consistent, very fair. High Enough gear ball. out to right. Olsen on the move. And out number Have one. Have you ever seen Matt Olsen grand. play right field? The catcher. Francisco. Francisco Mejia coming up to hit. The wide, the kick, and the one two. Way inside, gets out of the way. And now it's three and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Foul. We'll see another payoff pitch. Right hander kicks deals. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Right mm. side. All these. Tosses to first, and that quickly two away. And next is the designated hitter, Josh Lowe. The pitch. And that one wrapped foul. The one two. And that's too high. Short hop liner handled it short. They get the out, and that'll do it. Rays held in check here. They trail here, one nothing. Back here at Tropicana Field, and the batter now, Michael Harris. That misses the zone. Now two balls and a strike. Comes up empty. Wow. That's strike two. Swings and misses. Struck him out. Very frustrating right there as a speedy potential base runner when but two strikes, you just struggle to put the ball in play. You don't even have to get a hit at that point. You can help your team just by reaching on an error. But some way, you got to find a way to shorten up the swing and put the ball in play next time. Fires the second too late, and he's got a double. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. Austin Riley. Next My back can send it again. I wasn't able to. RBI knock for him last time. Now a chance to drive in another run. Runner leads away at second. That one missed. Two two down. And downstairs. Grissom cool. leads off second Thanks. with one gone in the inning. And he walked him. Mm. He's making things difficult for himself right now out there on the mound. But, you know, his confidence should still be high enough to get out of this. But he's going to have to buckle down right here. Swing and a you miss. Some girl Cleopatra gets every day or she doesn't, uh, she'll delete you. Here's Marcelo Zuna. And that'll load mm. the bases. It feels to me like his time on the mound is running short, starting to show some signs of fatigue. So we'll see how much longer they let him go. Stay with Dives, but it's off his glove. Yeah. Gets it there in time, though, and they come away with an out after a tricky start to the play. And the Braves set for the bottom of the third, and now it's Jose Siri. And the right hander deals. Fly ball down the line. Olsen settles under it. Hauls it in for the out. So the lineup flips over. Randy or Rosarena next to hit for the Rays. Fly out his first time. Out to down, center. Boy. Harris has a beat on him. He makes the catch, and there's two down. The right fielder, number six. 
Taylor Walls will hit next. Doubled in his first A.B. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. Two ball, one strike. Good eye right there. Three balls, one strike. Next offering is fouled back. Mm. Stays alive. And there's a fly ball, ball deep right field. Careful and that ball stand. is gone. Second he of the circles year. the bases, his second of the year, and this game is tied. It's 1-1. One, one. Bang. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit, spit on some other pitches in this at bat, was very patient, and it paid off. Isaac Paredes now spoils that one, and it remains 2-2. Two Just off the inside edge. Oh, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. In the air, right it. field. Dives, but it falls. And now it looks like extra bases. Matt Olson's a great right fielder. In the second, and he's got a double. Back to back base hits. A lot of times great in today's dive. game, right fielders are able to get to a ball that stays in like that, but he hit that one pretty well. And if he hits it just a little bit different on the barrel, it's out of here easily. But there's nothing wrong with the extra bases right there. Next offering upstairs. The strategy of winning a ball game, when you can make that pitcher work a little more, expose himself by throwing pitches, that could be the key to winning perhaps later on. So good job of extending this cool. inning, getting a knock with two outs to bring the number four hole hitter up. And he hits mm. a ground ball right side. Albies over to first in time. Lau out of the play. That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. Back here at the ballpark. And now the first baseman, Orlando Arcia. Out to short, me. Fires across the diamond. That's the first out in the top of the fourth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Swing and a miss. Going to count one and two. A wind in the pitch. In the air, foul off first. Ramirez pulls it down, two down. Two down. Here's Kevin Pilar. Kicks and deals. And there's a foul ball. Next pitch is inside. <laughs> And it's three and two. The lefty closing in on 100 pitches. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Ready to go. Bottom four. Here's the shortstop at the play. Curtis Mead. Next offering. Pop foul off to the right out of play. Well, these Rays showing great discipline at the plate, and patience definitely seems to be the name of their game in this one. Oh. He's only given up one run, but the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there, and that might be the best news yet for this offense. And here is Harold Ramirez. 0 for 1. He flied out to right this first trip. Come on, Harry. The surprise here is the bullpen is already stirring. Charlie Morton getting ready to come in for manager Brian Snicker. Swings and misses. It's two and two. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage, and that might be the case today. Struck him out swinging. The high heat too much on that one. With that kind of velocity yeah, yeah, and elevated yeah, yeah. fastball, even if it's still in the strike I'm zone, cranky. can be tough for hitters to get on top of. The 1-1. 
Swing and a miss. Nice changeup. And now two and two. And a pitch. Got him swinging. Chase the fastball up the ladder first. Welcome back. Here's the center fielder, Michael Harris. On the ground to first. And foul ball. You know, these Braves did a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient at bats out of them. I'm exhausted from watching some of these at bats. Lots of full counts and a ton of pitches with the starter still out there. They're taking up a lot of his energy. Vaughn Grissom next up for the Braves. Ground ball left side. Oh, look at the stop. And that's a Good great up. play for the out. Well, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough. Got out in front a little bit, rolled over on it, and beat it into the ground. Here's a big power threat. Austin oh. Riley. And there's a ball. Two balls, one strike. Two one pitches in there, and the count is even. This game has been so tight. Feels like the next team to score will win it. On the ground to third. Good start, Jeff. Paredes fires over to first. And that is that. A new pitcher in the game, Charlie Morton. He pitched yesterday, and we'll see him once again. Now it's the DH, Josh Lowe. Grounded out his first time up. And now two and one. Well, these Rays just lacking discipline at the plate in this ball game. So many of their outs have come from weak contact on pitches they're chasing outside mm. of the strike zone. Hands back. They can't do much of anything with those locations, and that's been true again today. Two two now. Back foot slider struck him out. Way out in front of that inside pitch there, and just exactly the opposite kind of approach that you want with two strikes. You want to let the ball travel. Make sure you recognize it. Try to shorten up so that you can at least put the ball in play. Clearly fooled, but I think even more so, you question the two-strike approach. Hey, man, four pitches, two outs. That is an excellent pace. That's towards center. Harris after it. Brings it in with a nice running grab. And that is that. Rays go in order. One, two, three. Score remains deadlocked at one. And we'll you still with us? Stepping in the long ball threat, Matt Olson. Matt Olson. The next pitch misses at a count two and one. That misses the zone, and that's ball three. And that one hammered. That's back. And forget it. When you're lacking velocity, it's so critical that you move the ball around, change speeds, even try to trick the hitter at times. But when you give up a home run right there, manager doesn't have a lot of patience because the velocity is um, I need your the, the number, now not the, the um, not the name. He's being eased into the game here with the bases empty. Hacks you know what misses. I mean? It's a strikeout. Like Cleopatra. Hers is 2161. And the righty deals. That's in there. One and two. One ball, two strikes. The one one is fouled off. Back to the mound. It hit him. Whips it to first on the run. The flip to the pitcher is late, and they come away without a doubt. Next to hit, Orlando Arcia. Line to right, and that'll be a base hit. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. That's back-to-back -back singles for him. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. On a second, they get one, and that's two. Braves get one on the big fly. Eight, nine, and it's now a 2-1 ball five, game. Five. You're watching Major League Baseball on the show. My bad. Send it again. It never went onto my screen. Back here at Tropicana Field, where we go bottom six. I'm sorry. Now it's the switch hitting outfielder, Taylor Walls. 
That one not close. Two balls and a strike. Action in the pen down there. Dylan Lee, the young lefty, looks to be getting himself ready. Swung out. Hey, 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 what has got an That's got into a chance. You. And that one is out of here. He flexes his power with Third that swing. Here. His second home run of the second game. Of the it's 2-2. Two -two. Zingy, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he has really seen the ball well in this one. Bang. That's exactly the pitch he was looking for. Crushes it and hits it out of the ballpark. And here is Isaac Paredes. Next offering is foul back. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. That one misses. Three and two now. Got him. And one away. The bat. Lau at the plate. Come be now. The pitch. And another ball. Now that's Get up, back Brandon to right Lau. center. Hmm. Lau out of the play. Two away. If you get a friend request from Cleopatra, Not that's my right that's there. my lady. He was clearly all over it, but sometimes you hit it too hard and right at someone. You're looking for one of those bloop hits to get a knock sometimes. Next pitch way upstairs. Got the bat going too soon at strike two. The pitch. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Solo shot ties it for Tampa. And we're deadlocked now. At top of inning number seven. And now the DH, Kevin Pillar. Swing and a miss. And he is down be on strikes for the third straight at bat. Ball to strike. The pitch. Bounce to the right side. Whips it to first. And two away to start the seven. And the batter will be the shortstop, Vaughn Grissom. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. And the pitch. Fouled off the plate. They'll do it again. Next offering upstairs. He wanted that fastball high and tight, looking for a strikeout. Just didn't locate it very well. In the dirt. Gets to it on to first. And it's in time for the third out, so that'll it. New pitcher for the Braves, Joe Jimenez. Well, he's a big-time strikeout guy out there. This season, averaging more than one per inning. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. And there's one away. And now the catcher for the Rays, Francisco Mejia. Here comes a pitch. Ripped on Get a down line. Ball. And he makes the catch. Out number two. Man, that's one of those at-bats where you have to remind yourself it's about the process. He did everything right right there. Nothing to show for it. But in your mind, you have to convince yourself that it was a very good at-bat. And a big swing and a miss. Trying to keep good speed off the bases. Mm. And delivers yep, outside. Out. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Down in order. Back now in Tampa Bay. Now the third baseman, Austin Riley. Hit hard on the ground to short. And that's one away. Yeah. As the leadoff man is out in the eighth. Here's Matt Olson. He's already homered in this game. The pitcher on here, Jalen Beeks. He's pitching on two days rest. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Couldn't catch up to the heater. Marcelo Zuna. Next up for the Braves. A strikeout and a walk. 
and that's ball four. Oh, you know this guy wants to swing it, but he's showing some good patience in this one. It's the second time he's taken ball four. Sean Murphy next up for the Braves. And now the count one and two after the swing and the miss. Clearly he was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. Two gone. The possible go-ahead run at first. Popped up to the left. Into foul ground. Paredes makes the grab, and that will end the inning. So a job well done by the Rays' bullpen. Home half of inning number eight straight ahead. We are tied 2-2. Colin McHugh will take over here, and he's done a great job on, keeping the ball in the park this year. The numbers stack up with some of the best in the game. Swing and a miss, chased it out of the zone. You know this guy's great speed is in the back of that pitcher's mind. If he can get on, it's going to give him one more thing he's got to think about. Let's go. Fair ball. Jose, get two. Safe at second with nobody range. out, and that double has the go-ahead run and scoring position. Well, that's one of those knocks where you almost expect to get some jabs from your teammates when you get back to the dugout. He probably would have been able to drive that pitch on the outside if he let it just get a little deeper and look to hit it to the opposite field. But he made it work out. Had a huge opportunity now to grab the lead at this point in the game. Now it's Randy or Rosa Come on, Randy. Here's a 1-1. One -one. And a sack bunt here. Tosses to first. They get the out on a Rosarena. The right fielder, number six, Taylor Wall. Now it's the right fielder, Taylor Walls. Well, both sides equally as strong. So not on, a good time to again. try to turn him around with a relief pitcher and put him on the other side of the plate. Ground ball right side. And he handles it himself for the out. Well, there's a lot riding on that at bat right there. Nice job of the pitcher to bear down, make the pitch, get the ground ball. Excellent piece of work. So two down now, and here is Isaac Paredes. Mm. Strike two. Well, you can't offer it that pitch in an 0-0 count. It's a strike, but not every strike is a good strike early in the count. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. Huge strike out there. We go to the ninth, and here's the first baseman, Orlando Arcia. The 2 1. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. On the ground, right side. He'll do it himself, and they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Here is Ozzie Albies up to him. The entire defense, infield and outfield, shifted to the left. And a pitch. This one popped up. And Albies is retired. And there's two down. Pitch hitter coming on, Travis Darno. And this is a big at bat in this ball game. 1-1 one, one now. In the air, fairly deep to right field. He's got it. And that is out number three. So, welcome back to the bottom of the nine. Now it's the second baseman, Brandon Lau. Next Good one enough. is off the play. And it's 2-1. Two 2-1 and one. Two and one the count now. He hasn't seen a fastball yet, but you've got to be ready to hit one because you doubt Good the eye. pitcher wants this to go to a 3-1 count. count. Bullpen activity starting up now. Dylan Lee, the closer of the staff, is throwing. Oh, and this Brandon one Lau, to send us to the all-star break, my friend. Let's go. 20th oh, yeah. day. Yeah. A towering shot. And the Rays walk it off. And win it 3 2. Get off the field, boys. Bang, 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 bang. Hitting a walk off homer is the kind of thing you dream about growing up. You're in the backyard, you're creating the most pressure packed scenario, and what do you do? You come through with the big swing.